is a box, a butterfly with the middle strike long and short. A box is simply, as we talked about, uh, you know what, why not uh, be able to use the tool here, let's see. Uh, a, a box is, is uh, a call, okay, and the way I could hear, real quick for you uh, by closing this out box for you and you'll see in the bottom here uh, I'll buy a box let me see if they have one here or if they're not uh, too into boxes <laughs> yeah that sector wasn't covered well basically a box is two verticals it's not a butterfly it's buying one vertical that's a bull spread and it's buying one vertical that's a put spread because no matter what happens with the stock, okay, if you buy the 55, 57 and a half strike, all verticals worth five. I mean, worth two and a half. If the stock goes to 50, the put vertical is worth two and a half. So either vertical will give you the full valuation of the two and a half dollar value, which is the difference of the strikes for the box. So one and a half in the middle. So let's say it closes at 56. Well, at 56, the call is worth a buck, and the put's worth a buck and a half. One plus a buck and a half is two and a half dollars, same valuation. No matter where you go with the price of the stock, when you're along the curl border price, uh, you're going to have the value, the difference of the uh, price of the strikes. Okay, let me see. Scroll down here. Yes, but in the example, when the box was priced, U.S. 250, how a retail trader could take advantage of this? Could one sell the box? It was overpriced? Absolutely. If, you, if you're able to sell that box at 258, go ahead. That's eight cents free money because it's going to go out at 250 at expiration. So you can enter a box and then get out once the stock moves. When you put on a box position, you don't have to do a thing to it. You can wait for expiration, and what happens is, Everything's going to come off, and you're going to realize the difference of what you paid for it if you bought it versus the strikes, or what you sold it at versus the strike, and hopefully you sold it greater than the difference of the strikes. John, it is it is it is definitely a risk management strategy. Not all the time is no one's going to really walk into the pit and say, "I'm going to sell this box at a, a, a two and a half dollar box. I'm going to sell it to you at two forty. Not going to happen because they're giving away nine cents or ten cents. It's basically something that you could leg into because you're doing the right strategies and you look at maybe the third or the fourth piece as a way to lock up the other side. So like I said, the goal here is to build positions and then be able to understand how to morph them into others, or take the profit off the table, or move them into a position that has even more profit potential, or to adjust it. It's a lot easier for you to do that and understand that then send Fari an email or me an email and say, what should I do? This is what we're trying to teach you. We're trying to teach you to be very independent and very self-manageable with everything that you're doing.